Welcome to ZineJet T7100 training module. In this module, we'll be reviewing print quality diagnostic tools. Banding is defined as the presence of extraneous lines in a printed page. Banding generally occurs when a color printer needs to pass the print head over a page multiple times to print each color. If the page isn't exactly lined up for each pass, lines may appear. If you notice banding in your printed document, there are a few steps you can do to improve print quality. The first is to ensure the media profile matches the media actually loaded in the machine. Here are the steps to do that. Verify paper type. Once you've confirmed the media profile matches the media loaded, the next step would be to clean the print head. To access this, you would back out of this section, go to the submenu labeled Image Quality Maintenance, select OK, scroll down to Clean Print Heads and choose to clean all, or you can clean one at a time. If after cleaning the print heads, you still see banding, the next recommended step is to calibrate the paper advance. To access this option, scroll up to Paper Advance Calibration, select OK, and select Calibrate Paper Advance. After calibrating Paper Advance, if you're still noticing banding, the third step would be to align the print head. Access this by scrolling up to Align Print Heads hitting OK and beginning the process. As you can see, the embedded web server will pull data from the DesignJet T7100 and make recommendations on the necessary steps to improve image quality. There are three other possible image quality problems that may occur. These are graininess, poor line quality, and color inaccuracy. As you can see, the DesignJet T7100 has steps built in to help you improve those problems. Those steps are very similar to the ones we just covered in the banding portion of this module, but include cleaning print heads, print head alignments, and advanced color calibration steps. After completing the recommended steps to improve print image quality, if you notice issues still ongoing with your printed documents, one further suggestion would be under the main menu, select Image Quality Maintenance and print the diagnostic image. This image can be used to gather important information on how to move forward. There are two important pieces of information that can be gathered from this report. The first is to ensure that all these areas are solid fills and you see no gap. The second piece of information that can be reviewed in this report is to verify that the printhead nozzles are firing properly. If there are large gaps in the printed lines here, that indicates that there is an issue and it's recommended that the printhead be replaced. 